one of the things that I work with the body on, and we continue to this day, is working on historic preservation of the tax credit. And by use of that, you can gather some uh, tremendous assets to improve the community. The mayor and the, the city council have been very progressive. This year alone, we're bringing 17 new businesses in retail, um, as well as service. So, I mean, we can see that growth in tourism brands. So, we're honored to have you here and delighted that you take the time from your schedule to do what you do for that. Say, our part of this is uh, this is how I actually got to know the Harris family is in working on the legislation in Springfield with our partners, uh, the American Institute of Architects in Illinois. They, they had talked with Bob Harris, Inga's father, about this project and the need for a state historic tax credit to help close the gap to then create all of this economic opportunity in the South. This building has to be the core of our economic development of the whole area, not only the South. The conclusions of the feasibility study, it's a viable business in a growing market segment, it's a stable investment, and I repeat the first sentence, it's a very, very important catalyst for the timeline. Always very difficult to say something about the timeline. So take this with a grain of salt. But I think this is doable. Uh, by next year, nine months from now, we should have a financial package. Uh, a few months later, construction plans complete. 2017 construction, and then sometime in 2018, all things complete.